Hello engineers, in this video we will explain how we can create an inventory for our Azure DevOps organizations. If you enjoy the content I create and you want to support my channel for free, press the like button and subscribe on the channel. In order to use the inventory script, you will need to navigate in the source folder and change the collect.ps1 file. This file has as inputs the organization that you need and you should place your organization name and the PET token in order to use the script. Then in the output, you will get organization details as the name, the project, repositories, pipelines and also the agent that are included inside this organization. Let's now demonstrate how we can use this script in order to export all those details. So first you will need to go in the repository and download it or fork it in order to have the collect.ps1 file. The second step that you will need to do will be to create a PAT token inside your DevOps organization. So you will go under personal access tokens and create a new token in order to gather information. So for these purposes, I will create a full access token and I will call it inventory. This token will be used inside the script. So now we will go and inside the repository that we downloaded, we will go and edit the collect file in order to change the organization name and also the token. In the organization name, you will need to use the Azure DevOps organization name. In my case is GE Alexiu and the token will be the token that you generated through the PAT token. So you will have to paste those values and then execute the parcel script. First, you will need to run a parcel session depending on your operating system. So as I'm running on Mac OS, I will press PWSH and then I will run the collect.ps1. So when the script starts, you can see that I am getting an export about the agent, the pipelines that I have created, the agent, the repositories and project that are inside my organization. If you need to include multiple organization inside the script in order to get information for more, you will need to go and just add another entry on the organization's hash table on parcel. So you will need to add another entry like the one that is shown in the above row. The instructions for that can be also found in the repository.